Hi, this is Vidya Balan. Download the Bollywood Times app right now. Good evening, viewers. My next guest. You know, I can just keep looking at you. Hello. If I stop. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, can we do it again? <laughs> no, no, you can start. I'll, I'll, I'll do like this, yeah. You know, I can just keep looking at you, staring in your eyes. Why don't I leave a picture of me here? You can keep looking at no, it. No, I want you in flesh. <laughs> That's <awesome. laughs> awesome. It's a late night show, ladies and gentlemen. No, it's an evening. Well, we have Mary Sulu presenting you to Mahari Sulu to everyone. How are you? Welcome. Very good. How are you? Times. I'm good. But you have, you, there's this mesmerizing appeal about you, Vidya. Really? Just not your voice. I remember Janvi's voice. Ah. The first time you went behind the radio. Yeah. 11 years ago. 11 years ago. It? I want to ask you, let's begin by asking you, how much of Janvi is embedded in Sulu? Except for the fact that they're both RJs, I don't think there's any similarity in personality. Hmm. Um... Yeah, you know, and I think at that time, of course, I thought I was very close to Janvi or Janvi was very much like me. But 11 years have passed. Yeah. And I think today I feel like I identify so much with Sulu. Mm. Um, so I'm glad it's not just me growing, but the roles are also <laughs> <laughs> growing. <laughs> Interesting. What's the most annoying question that you've ever been asked like, like a woman is asked that men don't in, a, in an interview. Oh God, so many. Uh, um, in an interview, of course, it's invariably about, uh, especially after I got married. <laughs> I've been asked, so uh, what are your thoughts about motherhood? So I have turned around and said, I think motherhood is great. You know, uh, if you want to have a child, you should go ahead and have the child, whether or not you're married. Hmm. <laughs> Just to, what, because yeah. what do you expect me to say about motherhood? What you're trying to say is, you know, when are you going to be a mother? I've been asked hmm. directly also because some people have tact, some people don't. So, and I'm like, it's a really personal question. True. You know, it's if my parents or my in-laws ask me, I would still understand <laughs> this. Like, when you chalta, I'm like, come, come. Interesting. Ah, yeah. Okay, and I, I always thought of this. I thought, okay, let me ask this question. What advice will Sulu, okay, give to, if Vidya Balan was 18 year old today? An 18 year old Vidya Balan. What advice would Sulu give to an 18 year old? Wow. Tu must say. Must? Jo karne ka kar, jo tera man kiya bol, kisi se dar mat. Muskurati rai, hasti rai. So you're saying the 18 year old Vidya Balan was a bit shy and reserved? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah? Yeah. That's interesting. Okay. You know, it's such an irony, okay? There's RJ Malishka in the film. Yeah. All right. And and literally when she took a dig at the potholes yeah. and did that lovely music video for which, you know, the political parties really, you know, mm. uh, went berserk after her. After her. Is this, it's pretty, I mean, the irony is in the fact that there's an RJ in a film where you're playing an RJ. Yeah. All right. And, matlab, khudana khasta agar kuch, you know, th there's some dig that you take towards anything. <laughs> are, you, are you afraid? <laughs> no, no, not at all. That's not even crossed my mind until you said it. But you know, it's amazing. Uh, Malishka and I went to the same college. Oh, okay. uh, Yeah, I remember meeting her on her first day in college. Because I think she joined Xavier's a year later. We're uh, the same age, we're the same batch, but I think she came in later. Oh, um, wow. So so I remember meeting her and then of course, over the years I've done interviews with her. As a matter hmm. of fact, for Lagera Humunna Bhai, Raju really liked her voice. And he said, you know, you must observe her. I was going around, uh, you know, visiting different radio stations, trying to get a sense of how radio jockeys really perform. Mm -hmm. And, you know, um, I just wanted to imbibe some qualities, qualities. from them. And um, I, I watched a lot of them, but I borrowed more from Malishka and her absolute live wire. Yeah, she is. Um, 
yeah attitude so and then therefore in a way i made my debut on radio with her and she's making her acting debut with me wow wow this is awesome <laughs> that's that's quite that is ironic you know it's uh it's quite funny also uh, so i kept bullying her i kept saying you know this is how it happens and said don't smile now <laughs> and she you know she she was always confused about whether to believe me or no and then she she's also an actor you know so she a good she'd one. mock yeah she'd mock uh like she'd be mock scared and say oh really uh, and i'd say they not tanki mat kar <laughs> but so no i that thought never crossed my mind that that maybe no 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 okay it's a clean film it is a clean happy family film so koi tension nahi only thing is that late night thing na is people have got aroused with it <laughs> you know what i'm saying like there are goosebumps like late really? night really <laughs> in india there's no concept of late night because anything which is late night is termed adult yeah correct right but tumhari sulu is not an adult film it's a family film it's a family film yeah okay is intuition uh, vital for you as an artist a, a performer when you're perform- performing as a, a very critical scene would you would you be you know uh, i think instinctive is the word I, i don't know if it's important i feel i am instinctive uh but i don't know if every actor is instinctive i don't know whether the best actors are instinctive or intuitive but i think i personally feel i am instinctive so i can't imagine it any other way mm. you're constantly sure. playing with emotions yeah True. so you know um and you begin to understand people that much better with experience mm. so i think your instincts are are sharp and they kick in uh, more sharply nice the three do's that an rj should be observing the three do's um you know retain your unique style mm. that's most important i think uh the other one is um unique style aise na ho ki log so jaye <laughs> you know i think it's very important live wire you said yeah not just you know you can not everyone needs to be a live wire hmm. but i think you need to be engaging therefore you need to know what's happening around you as an actor i don't need to keep um you know keep in touch with what's happening on a day in, in around the world on a day to day basis hmm. if i do it's a choice you know but as an rj i think when you go on air so that you're able to talk about different yeah, things true. you know and um yeah That's just one. have fun two more no i give you two okay one more <laughs> one more just have fun have fun yeah. and three don'ts three don'ts um three don'ts is don't try to be like anyone else so it's just don't fake it yeah don't <laughs> fake it you know because people just see through that and uh, it's important to be articulate so articulate not in terms of you know to to, to think th- a thought through because sometimes you're listening to an rj and they're saying the same word again and again oh isn't that amazing isn't that you mean repetitive and, shouldn't yeah, be yeah it's just annoying when you hear things like that because you know i can only hear your voice so i want you to engage me with my vo- with your mm-hmm. voice mm-hmm. and uh the third thing is um yeah i think just two don'ts okay ladies and gentlemen now let's play hawa hawai 3.0 on oh. hollywood times okay then <laughs> <laughs> okay the three 3.0 is my creation mm-hmm. of hawa hawai the first time with their you heard hawa hawai i remember i watched it oh, maybe watched on it. chitrahar or chaya geet or something i can't remember okay. where i remember i was fascinated because she pulls out a grape from her uh, headgear and has it and i wanted a headgear like that <laughs> of course <laughs> not I'm the not. grapes <laughs> <laughs> no with the grapes with i wanted grapes. to pull out a grape like that and she does it with so much chutspa you know mm-hmm. she's just so i i was like i loved her in that song and i can't even believe i've actually Paid a tribute to her. Yes, yeah, and it's bloody awesome. Thank you. The first time you met Sri Devi uh, was at Nalini and Yasmin um, at uh, the Sun and Sand Hotel. 
I had just taken a flight. I had just uh, become an actor in terms of I had just started doing films. This was probably between Parineeta and Munna Bhai. And I walk in and I see her and I freeze because I love her. So I, I didn't know whether mm. it would be rude of me to go up to her and say, you know, hello. Because, you know, after all, when someone comes to a salon, you want your space. So I looked at her and I kept looking and I wasn't sure. I thought if I don't go, is it disrespectful? Kuch samaj bhi nahi tha. And then suddenly I look at her and she smiled at me. She gave me the warmest smile. <laughs> and I was like, you know, she she gave me a very familiar smile. And she's Sri Devi for God's sake. <laughs> but I, I'll never forget that moment. And she was wearing a yellow top. Oh, you even know what she was yeah, wearing. Yeah, I remember very what she nice. was wearing. Nice. <gasps> Okay, and the last one, 3.0, the third one is the first time you ever got emotional watching a Sri Devi film. Uh, I think Sadma. Oh yeah, that's... I actually watched Sadma in Tamil. It's called Moon Ram Pirai. Um, before I watched it as Sadma in Hindi. And I can't tell you how she and Kamal Hassan in that film are just... You've watched yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, there are things... Innocence. As a child, I watched it as a child because mm. my parents were watching it on TV. Uh, we used to listen to the songs even otherwise. And I remember wanting to protect her as a child, even though she was a grown-up. That's the effect she has on you, yeah. Awesome. But whose decision was it to actually incorporate Hawa Hawaii? I think uh, Tanuj Garg, who's one of the producers at Ellipsis Entertainment, uh, and Bhushan Kumar. Um, I think they, they probably asked uh, Suresh Triveni and I think Suresh Triveni wanted to do cartwheels or something <laughs> that oh my god <laughs> that was his idea yeah 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 oh god okay moving on further this or that <clears throat> ready yeah online shopping or shopping in the store shopping in the store okay this becomes difficult huh, by the end yeah okay blue or red red okay I hate blue by the way I never wear blue. Indigo is fine, but uh, there have been a, there have been stray instances when I've worn blue because someone's really said, "No, you must. You're looking lovely, lovely, lovely." But I hate blue. at the movie, popcorn or samosa? Popcorn. Hmm. And it has to be be that salted caramel. I, I'm not really. I don't have popcorn regularly Regular in the movies. Yeah, the movie. um, but once in a while, when I do, then it has to be. I'm actually more a coffee person in the theatre. Okay, I was just going to ask, coffee or chai? Coffee. South Indian. <laughs> South Indian. Yeah. Madhuri or Sri Devi? Sri Devi. Hawa Hawaii or Oh La La? Hawa Hawaii, any day. Ekta Kapoor or Tanuj Garg? Tanuj Garg because... <laughs> no, Tanuj Garg yes. and Ekta will understand why. <laughs> nice one. I think I got it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You know... When I thought the film is about an RG and, and the first trailer hit out and I, after speaking to Tanuj also, he said, you know, it's about this uh, common uh, man's life and, you know, the couple and, one, you know, the wife turning uh, an RG late night. And I thought, wow, what if a musical was made out of it as well? Because we yeah. haven't seen any musicals, right? I mean, RJ's predominant Maybe job is to play music. Sulu 2.0 now. For all you know. Yeah. No, but the, the, the job of an RJ is to play music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so that's the job. Yeah. And why not we have a brilliant music? It would actually musical? be fun. Except you couldn't have me singing. <laughs> no, why not? Why not? I, how are, how are you? But you have a good voice. Actually, you have a brilliant voice. You have a brilliant voice. <laughs> that's my singing voice. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now I've got something special for you, Vidya. Huh? Does it make you excited? Yeah, because you always give me very good gifts. Okay, so... But only after playing this okay. and seeing how you perform. Okay. So I'm going to name a few celebrities. Mm. You're going to absurdly, randomly, crazy, however you want to, mm. name a radio show after them. Okay. Okay. Random. Okay. Sanjay Dutt. Uh, or which show he would be hosting, if that makes it simpler. I know this sounds cheesy, but Lagi Raho. <laughs> <laughs> Lagi Raho is Baba. Lagi Raho Munna Bhai. Okay, that way. Ranbir Kapoor. Ranbir Kapoor? Would be uh, the Besharam rock star. <laughs> <laughs> Alia Bhatt. Uh, Your way or the highway? 
ए नाइस वन नो नो दैट्स योर टर्न हेलो या या योर वे ऑफ द हाईवे अच्छा रणवीर सिंह हाई वोल्टेज गुड शो या रियली वरुण धवन मैं तेरा हीरो अच्छा एंड सलमान खान मेरी शादी कब होगी ऑल द सिंगल कपल या या द लिव इन ही ही आई थिंक ही डू अ शो वेयर ही इज एक्चुअली मैच लाइक प्लेइंग क्यूपिड सो व्हिच इज व्हाई मेरी शादी कब होगी आल्सो फॉर हिमसेल्फ और लेट्स से ऑन ऑन योर शो इफ इट वुड बी लाइक व्हेन सल्लू मेट सुल्लू दैट्स ट्रू time for the gift okay just have it <gasps> lovely how i'm awesome. telling you i love the gifts you give and that's why i'm yeah. beshar and i want to keep coming on your show <laughs> keep coming please <laughs> this is a rare one though yeah it is it is thank you for all you know siddharth will flick it <laughs> because he'll want to read it before me but thank happy you. reading happy we'll reading share it. you should not the bookmark <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna play a game. Never have I ever, all right? Never have I ever dedicated a song to Siddharth Roy Kapoor via radio. If you were to, which one would it be? Uh, if I were to, it would be <laughs> it would be uh, Mitwa. Never have I ever sung karaoke and sucked at it. <laughs> <laughs> When was this? Was like long time back? Uh, no, recently at a house party. Wow, interesting. But every time I do it, I suck at it. <laughs> Hindi song or English? Hindi. Oh, Hindi. Okay. Never have I ever fallen in love at first sight. You have. So that's Roy Kapoor, <laughs> lucky man. Never have I ever bunked school or tuition for a movie. Never. Never. Because when I was growing up, people didn't go to the movies. The video revolution <laughs> happened. The VHS. And yeah, you would watch it at home. Okay. So I didn't have to bunk school. No, but please, for tomorrow, Sulu, go to the theaters. On the seventeenth of no- November. Never ever ever been bullied on a set. You been bullied? Yeah. By whom? <laughs> I remember um, on my first day of shoot for Hampanch, uh, Rakhi Vijan. Yes. Bullied me. She really, I think she was trying to rag me. <laughs> Or just say she was playing a character. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. <clears throat> the the very yeah. effervescent. What, what is that yeah. the one you're talking about, right? Yeah, yeah. Wow, man. I mean, do you remember those things? Yeah, of course. Like those vivid memories of your first ever. Yeah, actually, that wasn't my first ever. I did another TV show before that, which mm. never came on air. Okay. So that would be a never. It's just like Salman Khan's first movie was Bivi Ho to Aisi, but nobody knows. Yeah, but I recognized him even then. Oh, huh? because okay. I had watched Bivi Ho to Aisi. I loved the way Bindu said, "Secretary." Ah, <laughs> uh, secretary. <laughs> <laughs> well, you played well. Thank you. Uh, I should have got the bookmark, but unfortunately, I don't. So I'll have the slate back. <laughs> Thanks, Vidya. You're a sport. You are one. Okay, going back all the way, mm. coming back all the way to sexist. Okay, what single thing? Okay, would you change about the film industry to make it less sexist? Uh, what would I? What is the single thing that I would change to make it less sexist? Give male and female actors uh, the same amount of money. <laughs> you know, once that changes, everything will change. You sure? Yeah. Actually, that was uh, a debate that Jennifer Lawrence and Meryl Streep started in 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 yes. Hollywood. Yes. Yes. About the same wage yeah. debate. Yeah. 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 And you know what? No matter how much we try to avoid this, this whole wave, this whole tsunami of uh, of the news that hit us a few weeks back about Harvey yeah, yeah, Weinstein. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. You ever think in Bollywood, in 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 the in largest spectrum of just not Bollywood, but I'm saying the whole entertainment fraternity in India, including regional cinemas and everything. You think we are so ballsy to name uh, the personality or someone who has you know sexually assaulted or harassed uh, an individual um i think we're getting there for sure you know and uh, i would like to believe that the incidents of sexual harassment have reduced now because people 
must be scared na mm-hmm. ki yeah. the girls have mobile phones or even the boys sometimes they also get sexually harassed they have mobile phones they could just keep the Record. video on and then you're you know screwed for life so i would think that people are more careful now uh but having said that i think we're not far away from people naming anyone in the industry or outside yes no oh, the party I mean, is over anis <laughs> and the show is too unfortunately unfortunately and thank you so much for coming on the show vidya thank you for having me uh, on the show for the third time and for giving me lovely gifts hi this is vidya balan download the bollywood times app right now Thank you for watching. For Bollywood's latest updates, subscribe to Bollywood Times right now.